Yo, what is going on everyone? It's Professor Pierce PP for short. Today we are looking at a trapping deck. Uh, it's, it is pretty mid, I'll say that. This is definitely definitely not the best deck. Um, the idea came to me in a dream, actually. Um, and dreams are, you know, not always perfect. So, uh, it, it's based on putting together uh, with Metacham and Pokenum and then using and hopefully using a uh, the spite ops on your bench to keep them from retreating and when you poke them you get rid of a move they use and hopefully they only have one move or if they have another one they can't use it uh, so you just keep poking them and doing like chip damage and you're either going to try to deck them out or you're gonna try to uh, do enough damage slowly over time to get them right where you want them and uh, and take them out and take some prizes with the other support you got in here. Um, it's pretty interesting to say the least. Uh, I'll explain a bit more, you know, when the video goes on. But uh, that's about the gist of it. Is um, <laughs> it is something interesting. Well, we'll go ahead and get started here in just a minute. All right, so we're facing. I am not even gonna attempt to pronounce that because I will get ridiculed in the comments for it. I'm sure. All right. Flip heads, got heads. First time in a while we got that. So let's -a go. So the idea with this deck, like I said before, is to just trap them in. It's the main thing we want to do here. Um, so it's not too bad of a start. Um, we can, uh, I was gonna say we can maybe mountain hunt, but we don't have that fighting energy. Um, but not like, I mean, we're going first anyway, so it's not like we're gonna mountain hunt anyway. And it's taking a sweet time here. Well, it seems like we're playing Maridon though, which would be really good for this deck. Cause that's what, that's about the only thing this deck can be. I'll tell you that. From a lot of testing, a lot of testing, too much, too much testing. That's a good, it's uh, a good start though. And it is Maridon, but he's got the flex card, so it's not, not giving me a lot of hope. I'm gonna go ahead and grab another spider. Go ahead and just put some energy down. Let's see if we get a fighting energy here. Uh, I, I'm in on this one. That's also not bad. Um, that's a good turn because we've got research for turn two too, and we can um, and we can evolve a, a spite off as well. Let's see what my man's got over here. Let's see if he's got the turn two donk. Probably not, if I had to say so, because he's got to do a lot of damage, and I didn't give him enough on my bench for. I don't. Well, 240, 100, 100, no. I mean, if he gets enough on his bench, he actually, that, that would still be enough. So I guess I shouldn't have put down something on my bench, but that's, you know, that's when you, you figure stuff out in the long term, because you always go back, <laughs> like I was talking about before, you always go back, and then you're like, why did I do that? You know, obviously I wasn't just thinking that far ahead, but you you, you got to do stuff like that, you know. Um, tell you how you learn, how you learn and grow, how you not know how to use Drapion. You just gotta, you know, you just gotta count count to four with Drapion. It's pretty it's pretty hard. Alright, so I'm not really sure. I guess he just wants to draw more cards here. Which is fine. Yep, alright, let's see what we got here. Fighting energy, that's not bad. That is good. I don't really want to use that one, though. Um... I don't want to go ahead and save that as well. 
I wish I had the other one, but doesn't seem like we're going to be able to get it right now. But we will be able to puncture them. We'll go ahead and do this. And we'll put that up top because we'll probably, in case he gets a switch, we'll be able to, to do something here. I guess he switches and, and kills us. So alright, so yeah, that's, that's kind of how it is. We, we got one of them up. So his Rashid cost is two right now, and we punctured him, and he can't use that attack, his only attack. Uh, so he's kind of in a weird spot here because he's got to have an escape rope or something. But, you know, most Maridon decks only run like one or two escape ropes and then a bunch of beach courts. And obviously the beach court's not really going to help because he's going to have to, you know, uh gonna have to just put more energy on it to retreat and he doesn't really want to do that because it looks like this build anyway is not running Mareep. So he doesn't really have a way to get stuff out of his discard besides probably energy recycler but we'll see here because he's definitely running one of those. Kind of fleet footed from the active spot uh, speaking of the devil, okay, does it already. That's quite interesting. Kind of surprising, honestly, but I guess he had a couple in there. So he probably only has that one, so that one's probably just gone. But there's the beach court, so I guess he's gonna... I don't really know what he's gonna do here. I guess he's just looking for switch cards and generators. My exploration did not matter though, which is kind of annoying. Maybe I'll, I'll pull another gutsy pickaxe here from the top. Let's see what he's got. He's probably got nothing in his three card hand now. Well, speak of the devil. Um, I'll just go ahead and give him spite ops and I can attack with it. See what he switches into. Man is thinking. I can freaking smell him from all the way over here. How hard his brain is making smoke. Holy crap. Bro, just give me freaking Mariah on already. I know that's what you're gonna do. Maybe it's just AFK or something. No, he's okay. He's gonna give me the baby one. Maybe he's got electric energy and it'll switching pulse me. Or switching bolt me. I don't know. Okay. What is he gonna do here? He was he what could he even be grabbing that he doesn't already have? Okay. Interesting. You still have a retreat cost of one though, so it's not like you can retreat. I don't think he thought that through. Probably thought the beach court worked for basics, or worked for evolutions. He probably just forgot, honestly. We will grab this and we will draw some cards here. Just kind of want to get rid of get rid of my hand. Free draw eight, unheard of. So we'll go ahead and use that. And get nothing. I kind of just want to get rid of his bench here. I want to see what he does. Probably gonna just get rid of the two Maridons. Um, might get rid of the Greninja, but nah, he's not gonna get rid of the Greninja. Um, let's see. He's gonna take another, <laughs> take another 20 years to do this. That'd be that'd be great. Oh my God! 
So you guys got snacks? I'm assuming you got snacks. I hope you got snacks. This this one's not even on me. He can't even say anything. He's just being slow. Alright, so he got rid of... He did get rid of the Greninja, but he also got rid of one of the Maridons, which is surprising. Um, so we'll go ahead and get this other Spide Ops down, which is good. So now he's got Big Boy Retreat. And we're just going to have to... Uh, have to hit him because I mean there's no point of using the first attack because he doesn't have the energy so might as well just gamble here uh, I could hit him with spy ops but like it's it's not really worth hitting him with spy ops I mean I can hit him for more damage here so and it seemed like it paid off though for all right so he's trying to retreat I'm guessing doesn't really have much to do nice see he's trapped Trapped in here. So obviously we're not going to go for another gamble again. Um, I guess that would be a little, a little much. But we will kill him here with spider ops. Boom. We're going to take our three prize cards. Epic. Imagine losing to a fucking Metacham. Bro, you, you 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 take the energy and you put it on your bench Pokemon that has it on there, or you don't do that. It's not that hard. All right, let's see what he's got here. Bench is full. Um, he'll probably tandem unit. Let's see what he's got. Okay, he, en he ended his turn. Um, we're just gonna attack here. I don't think he meant to do that, but uh, we'll just attack. interesting I man probably maybe it was having a glitch or something I mean this game definitely not perfect by all means probably just glitched out and ended his turn for him or maybe he just accidentally hit it who knows uh, the only annoying thing here is if he puts up a Maridon. on then I can't really do anything to it damage wise but no he's gonna put up that which is fine because he'll have I can do more damage to this at least because it's not a basic because I don't think this deck runs any stadiums so he does seem like he's trapped here maybe maybe that's just what happened last turn I mean he probably thought he was gonna attack but uh, I don't know I don't know to be honest with you here uh, we'll just attack. Just for 150. See if we can get, um, get another Spide Ops, maybe. Then that would just kill him. Or we can attack with the Metacham or, or something if we have to. Let's see what he's got. He's got bub kiss. Alright, so we might have to attack with the Metacham here. Um, might as well escape rope. Don't want to waste energy here. Because I got the boss in hand, so, you know. Because we did not get another way to get Spide Ops. And holy crap, this guy is just playing the long game. He's trying to time us out or something. I mean, this is going to put me to sleep.
But yeah, we don't really got much of a choice here except to just pray that we we get the flip again. Because if we don't, then I mean, you know, we can get it next turn. Like, statistically, we would get it one out of this turn or next turn. And that's how long it would take us to kill him with the spite ops. So, easier so, so easier just to, to gamble it away. And we got it, though. So... That is the first game. Uh, that's that's ideally how it's supposed to work. Obviously, it's pretty difficult sometimes just because of uh, uh, your setup usually. But um, let's we'll see what we got here for this next game. Oh, I'm going to try to pronounce this guy's name. Um, it could be one of two things. I'm thinking Laplace T is probably the most normal and then it could be Laplace T so it could be Laplace or Laplace I don't know um I hate English so much <laughs> alright anyway back to the fight we kinda got um a terrible setup here could have waited to put the fighting energy on something else here, but I doesn't really matter all that much. Cause I got a lot of energy. Let's see what uh, let's see what this guy's got here. Plan lost box. Looks like it. Let's see if it's. Lost Box Scudra, or just Lost Box Dragonite, or just Lost Box. We will find out. And he's got the turn one Chorus. Oh boy. He hasn't found the Battle Pass yet. So that's something. Um, Alright, let's see. No battle pass. Good sign. He is gonna get four in in the loss zone to start. Oof, that's not what we wanna see. Yeah. Well there goes our tarantula. Maybe if we draw a right hand or something that'd be good, but it's not really gonna be to research. Um Just check and see if we got in here, nothing. Crazy. Alright, well, he's gonna take the first donk, which is kind of annoying. Let's see what we got here. Maybe now we can mountain hunt, like I was saying in that first one. Uh, well, that's not what I want. But, bye bye. Oh my god, what is this hand? Um, what is this hand? So do I go ahead and V-Star, or do I even use Explorers? So, what, man, what is this? This is not what we need. Um, okay, this clearly doesn't matter what order it's in. Um, I'm just gonna pass, honestly. Cause like, oh my goodness. Because if he, if he puts down more mons, I'll just Avery, but if he doesn't, then I'll just Judge, um, and I hope he, <laughs> hope he can't kill anything. And I'm going to evolve, too, solely for the fact of, uh, I don't want this thing two-shotting me. Uh, okay, so he is playing Gudra. Oh, boy. Um... So he should have six in there now, so he still can't do it yet, so he needs to switch. He's got enough cards in his hand to probably pull it off. Why didn't he place it on the... Okay. I'm not sure why he didn't place it on the cram, but... To two-shot me, but alright. Alright, so I'm just gonna have to judge, um, which is fine. Because he's got he's still got cards in his hand. Let's see what we got here. Go ahead and play this. Just grab another. Medit Medit is it Meditite? 
Yeah, meditate. All right. So we got so that's that's skin. That's not bad. Um, as we'll go ahead and level ball for our other boy. We have a lot of tarantulas prize, which is a big problem. Uh, just because we don't have a way of really trapping in anything here, but it could be worse. Uh, he can't. I mean, if he gets the Gudra up this turn, he can kill us. But I judged him, so hopefully he doesn't have that. I was hoping he didn't have the Gudra at all. Um, but hopefully he can just... Yep, there we go. Okay. That was probably the best case scenario for this turn. Alright, so we're gonna... Obviously, we're gonna place this on here. I don't really get much of a choice, though... Still, just want to check. There's no tarantula boys in here, which is annoying. And then we'll go ahead and uh, take this thing out. The only problem is he's gonna. Ugh, the, wow, that was like <laughs> that was the worst possible prize I could have picked. Oh my god. Yeah, because see, there's, uh, there's only one in there. Um, but alright. Uh, I needed that tarantula, not the spine ops. But I was going to say, the worst thing is that he's going to put up the comfy and then get to seven. So if he has the mirage gate, then that's a problem. And obviously if he has a switch too, that's even bigger problem. Okay, there's problem number one. Um, Is he gonna switch? See, he's thinking, he's thinking. He's got an escape rope. Um, that's fine, I guess. I mean, I'd rather him just kill this thing. Unless he has a boss, too. That'd be honestly very surprising. In that card game. Oh my! Oh! What the heck? Man, that was a terrible judge by me. What are the odds of that? Wow, that's crazy. All right, so we're gonna have to do some stalling here. This thing does have four retreat costs now though, so, and it only has the one attack, so that's good. So we're gonna judge, and then we're gonna attack, and then just hope he can't do anything. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and just burn this. Uh, I don't really know if I wanna take this out of my deck. I don't really want to. There we go. So he can't use that anymore. Hopefully he can't retreat. Um, he's got another chorus though. Man, what the heck? What am I judging him into? I'm, like making things worse. I don't know. Way another Gudra V Star. Whatever he had there must have been good. Um, it's probably a switch then. Yeah, there's a switch. Um, let's see, I wonder if he's running Sableye too. I mean, probably not, but he is running Cram. So that's interesting. So, let's see. I'm assuming he has the switch back. He does, unfortunately. Man, this guy really, really has everything he needs here. Um, it's kind of annoying. So I think I'm gonna yeah, go ahead and use this, get the grass for the spider ops. And then we'll just dump the hand. Doesn't really matter. Just burn some cards. Mm, yeah, I was, I was thinking about it now, looking back. 
I probably shouldn't have put that down. There's no reason to because I'm not going to build it up and I already used my V-Star. So putting that down would just be boss bait. That's probably the one thing I'm, I'm really bad at is just like, not like board state knowledge, but like just putting down cards like that. Like it doesn't, that doesn't help because he could just boss now he can just boss it out and kill it and win if he has the switches. But let's see. He's used a lot of switches at this point, so. Doesn't have it. Alright, well that's good. Uh, so, what's, what's going to be kind of hard is I'm going to go ahead and do that because I don't need him having that boss in his hand. The only problem here is I can't kill him with the spy ops. So I'm going to have to keep puncturing him until I can keep him with the spy ops and just hope that he gets stuck. Lord knows he's not trying to switch out. Well, okay, he can switch. Oh my god. Okay, he can switch, but like, he can't, <laughs> he can't switch with... He's probably not going to switch with four retreat and give up four, is what, I'm, is what I'm trying to say. All right, let's see what he's got. He's definitely doing some thinking here, so it's got to be important. So he's just going to hand it back over to me. This is kind of a problem. I'm just going to have to boss him because I don't want... I don't want him getting a free attack. Alright, let's see. What does he got? What does he got? He, he already has more switches than I thought he would, honestly. Um, Alright, damn it. He's gonna Moisture Star because he knows he's gonna die if he doesn't Moisture Star. Which is kind of smart by him. Um, or just keep, keep ticking away, man. Let's see what he's got. He's just fishing for the boss at this point, honestly. A boss and a switch. <sighs> Get rid of yeah, a bunch of dog shit. Um, another Gudra, okay. Oh, okay. So he has a switch. I gotta give him this. Does he? There's no way he has boss in his hand and a and another switch card. No shot. Okay, he does not. Barely bought myself another turn. <laughs> Let's see. Um, we're gonna boss it out. Um, we'll just attack, honestly, because no problem in not attacking at this point. Cause he can't kill me here but I guess if he had a um, if he has the boss in his hand then he just wins well fuck that sucks um, I guess I could have played that differently I could have played it a little more safe but like what are the odds that he had his boss in his hand that turn uh, I think he had two more in the deck unfortunately it seemed like but I mean two out of like what eight 18 20 cards he had left that's pretty surprising um well it doesn't matter too much but uh you know that's how it is this uh this deck you know like i said is very experimental um it was just for fun versus like a lot of the other decks are also for fun but they're a little more a little more competitively viable this one was pretty bad but just wanted to want to run a few tests even dream you know the dream the dream told me i had to make it so i had to make it 
I want to thank you guys for, for watching the video. Uh, take it easy. I uh, hope you finished your snacks probably in the first five minutes. So, you know, some of these guys are start taking their sweet time. Uh, thanks again. Uh, Professor Pierce out. PP out.